Hey, James. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, I was just wondering if the meeting was on or not. Yeah, I think Taylor's in, sitting in Slack that he's joining. Um, you know, David's out right now. So um, holiday? Yeah. That sounds nice. Yep. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's an agenda for today, so might be pretty quick. Did anybody have anything they wanted to chat about today? Thank you. Uh, I, nothing for the agenda, but uh, I was going to mention, uh, I know it's lightly attended meeting, so I don't know how much it's <laughs> worth mentioning, but uh, we have in public beta um, a WebAssembly component registry uh, at wa.dev. Um, cool. using the word protocol right now, but we're also going to support OCI. Would you mind dropping a link into the yeah. thing there? Yeah. Looks like we got a couple more people trying. I think that's worth mentioning. Yeah. Cool. Looks like somebody's setting up the the notes right now. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> nice. Okay. I'll let, let you finish and then I'll drop it in. You're ready to go. Do you, do you want me to add it under the agenda or create a new section, some sort of announcements or? Sure. Uh, yeah, I think agenda is good. Under the agenda, okay. Yeah, sorry. I, I don't think I typically run this meeting, so kind of making it up as a go here. There's Taylor. I know. Just did a call for some agenda items. So the I forgot to put them on last night, but I did think about them. Um, so the the only one I had in mind was mostly around the just a quick update on the OCI work we've done for people, and then um, any Wasm news like normal, and if there was anything else coming out of KubeCon people wanted to to talk about. I have the agenda now too, so I can add these. Calvin, I assume that's you adding um, that right now. Do you want that under the Wasm news section? Yeah, uh, should move that to news section. Yeah. Okay, hold on. No, I got it. I was just making sure I organized it right. Yep. Thanks. I'll put the news there. And... Okay, 
It's 9.08, so I guess I'll go ahead and get it kicked off. Um, welcome, everyone, to the uh, WASM Working Group call for, uh, what is today, April 2nd, where I'm at. Um, and it's our first call back from KubeCon, so we're a little bit uh, light today, and it's kind of expected. I also think it's spring break in a lot of places, in at least the U.S., so I think a lot of people are out. Um, so for anyone catching up later, hope you're having fun on your vacation and, gla and glad you're not here and instead vacationing. Uh, so um as as per usual this is a working group that is part of the cncf and is governed by the cncf code of conduct which basically boils down to be nice and respectful of each other so please do not um, do or say anything that would be in violation of, of that so okay with that we're gonna go ahead and kick off the um agenda for today like i said it's relatively light um we're gonna go over an oci update then talk about some wasi cloud updates and then um go into just kind of the normal Wasm news section that we like to do here at the end so people are aware of what's going on. Um, so James, since you're here and I'm already doing doing the meeting and probably the Wasi Cloud thing, do you wanna go ahead and give an update on where we're at with the OCI stuff? Yeah, I think we're getting really close. Um, we've discussed the config at this point. We've also discussed the different types of layers. And um, I think we're gonna meet one more time next week. There is one follow-up question on kind of how different applications consume um, the different layers. Uh, and then we're gonna just as a group for the folks to show up, kind of make sure we're okay with going forward if there's any last items and then plan on bringing it back to this group and sharing it more fully um, in, I guess it would be two weeks from now, uh, unless something else comes up. So uh, getting pretty close to um, finalizing that. Awesome. Thanks, James. Yeah. I'll just note that like, we're hoping that next time we'll be able to have those discussions. And then, I mean, in the off chance, we all mostly agree, then we could just be done. But in the, the likely chance that people might have some other questions, it'll give people some time to have like one more meeting and then have a final um, vote on it. But basically, yeah, we're there. So um, anything else you want to say there about uh, OCI, James? That's everything I got. And a huge thanks to everyone who's been participating. Brandon's been doing a bunch for us from the OCI, OCI side, making sure we're staying on track. So huge thanks to him, as well as everyone else who's been there helping us kind of dig through all the different issues and the um, things we've been discovering. So it's been it's been fun. Um, okay, just a quick update on Wasi Cloud. I've been trying to do that because there it's of obvious interest to us in the cloud native space. So um, just for an update here. Um, we merged a change um, that I discussed be an issue and in, in here of making the WASI config, the runtime config, be a hash map of string string, essentially, when it comes through. Um, and so that has been changed um, to to be that now. So those are the things we're going to be implementing. I can say, at least from the from the uh, being putting on my WASM cloud project maintainer hat, we're going to be implementing that in the next week or so. Um, so that one is, I think, at a point, it's very simple. So if you are a cloud runtime and want to support that, um, I'd love to see some some support for that landing, especially because it's so easy to implement. There's two functions and then that's it. Um, so uh, just a heads up for people that that's there. We want to get some implementations out and keep moving that those phases forward. Uh, there is also a key value one that I opened. Let me drop that in here. Just need to grab the... Um, I, I got together with a bunch of different people in the, um, uh, in the space, some friends over at Fermion and who are also have like a key value interface they've been using for a while, just like us. Um, I talked to a couple other people in the community as well, and we, um, proposed a streamlined, um, key value interface. Um, it was getting a little bit complex from my, my at least my opinion. And so, um, we've, uh, oh yeah, and Joe's here. Thanks to Joe. Joe is also on board with all, uh, with helping us out with all this. Um, and so anyway, there's still some open discussion items on there. Um, I expect Wazi key value to be one of the next ones that land. Um, and I've been saying this out in public just so kind of people know the, the rough order in which I think these are going to be landing over the next month or two for at least initial like implementation and using them are obviously Wazi config, which is basically their Wazi key value, and then probably um, blob store than messaging. Um, in that order. 
uh, is probably the, the most likely thing. There's some stuff we have to work through on the, the messaging side, um, some disagreements about what, what should be in there and what shouldn't. So anyway, just letting people know that these things are landing. Um, we're trying to make sure they're as publicized as possible. So um, if you haven't seen their runtime config interface, I guess I should probably link that too. Give me a second. Um, there we go. So what is on main right now inside of runtime config is um, what hopefully we should just be using to uh, to implement it all. Um, yeah, would love to see that. I, I imagine that's something that could be useful, uh, James, in the Renwazi space. I'm not sure what what kind of interface things you're going to be implementing directly in it or not, but if you are, let me know and love any feedback there. So um, I think that's it for the Wazi Cloud updates. Um, just, yeah, feel free to jump into any, anything that's going on there. We appreciate any feedback or ideas from there, especially since, like I said, like the CNCF as a whole was kind of one of the big target audiences for this. So, so, uh, this is our chance as the working group to provide any feedback we have for them as we continue to iterate over them, but I'll keep everybody up to date. Um, so anyway, I think that's it for Wasi Cloud. Any questions, other comments? Okay, awesome. Well, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the news section. So this is the time for anyone who has any general WebAssembly news to uh, to talk about it. Um, just like for, for those who might be coming to this call for the first time, we try to do this every time we meet so that um, this can be a good source of information about new happenings in the WebAssembly space. So you can keep up to date. I know it can sometimes be hard. So um, we'll go ahead and pass up. There's one that's was already put on there by Calvin. Um, so Calvin, you want to go ahead and, and, and give you a little update? Sure. Uh, yeah, since uh, I mentioned this earlier on the call uh, before a bunch of other people joined, but um, uh, now in public beta, we have a WebAssembly component registry uh, available at wa.dev. And I also linked to the YouTube talk um, that uh, Danny and Oscar uh, presented uh, at Waz My Own by Barcelona a couple of weeks ago. Um, so if people are interested in experimenting with that. Um, and uh, Taylor, I yesterday added um, uh, the ability to add owners and members to a namespace and give package level config. So if you want to play with that for Cosmonic, um, uh, any feedback anybody has around it? But right now it's based upon the Ward protocol. And we're uh, planning on supporting. I have a prototype of the uh, of implementing the same thing up for our OCI. Um, and you know, I was waiting for uh, our agreement on how OCI artifacts are all going to work um, to to put that live. Uh, but we're we're getting really close with that, so I would expect that coming soon. Thanks, Calvin. Yeah, so everyone go check that out. Um, the notes are, or the links are in the notes as well, so you can go check those out there. Um, the other thing that just reminded me of, because you had mentioned your Wasmio talk, uh, the Wasmio talks are slowly coming out. Um, so we'll once they're all out, I'll try to say, hey, they're all out, and here they all are. Uh, but those those are slowly coming out. But there is, I'll put it here in the message in the in the chat and in thing. Um, the Cloud Native Wasm Day talks are all out. Um, so if you want to go catch up on that, there was some real good, um, real good uh, content from that. So um, if you like, go go take a look, look at any uh, look at any uh, things there that you want to. And if if anyone meet, wants to like go over some of the things that were in there, just let people know because a lot of the people who are talking are here. Um, I talked, Joe talked, <laughs> like um, other people who generally attend this meeting were talking. So um, just if you have any questions, like. Put them out there. We they, it was really good. There was some real good content from from this uh, Wasm day, even though it was only a half day this year. So, um, yeah, I think that was the 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 only ones that are out so far. We're gonna, like I said, hope Wasmio comes out with some more here soon. Um, the only other conference related thing is I know that a couple of us, I know some of the folks from Spin are gonna be there. I'm gonna be there at Open Source Summit giving some Wasm related talks. So anyone who's interested in that, um, I'm gonna be there, please feel free to hit us up and say hi. Um, I And always, if you if there's any like Wasm related talks people in this community are giving like at any of these conferences that other people are likely to be attending, 
um, please let people know in this meeting because I think it's good to share that around and get the, that content out and available for people. Okay. Any other news items from people? Awesome. Well, like I said at the beginning, I figured this would be nice, sweet, and short. Short, sweet, short, and sweet. That's the way it's supposed to go. Um, so anyway, next uh, next meeting. So we're going to have the um, OCI, hopefully the last OCI meeting next Tuesday. Tuesday after that, we'll be covering, we'll probably take a decent chunk of the agenda time, and I'll make sure it's on the agenda to talk over the OCI stuff and, and what it looks like with everybody um, here in this meeting. And um, hopefully we'll have a good, fruitful conversation there. So with that, thanks everyone for attending today. Hope you all have a great rest of your week and we'll see you all at the next meeting.